Good morning, it's June 25th, 2022. This is a letter from Brother Joseph Branham at the Branham Tabernacle in Jeffersonville, Indiana. Here is Brother Joseph. Dear Greatest Faith Bride, I know this is just a simple letter with improper grammar, but I want the world to know that we believe every word our prophet said and accept it to be, thus saith the Lord. When we hear him say something on tape, we believe it, we accept it, and then personally receive it as God himself speaking directly to us. It has been preached and thoroughly vindicated by the word of God that it couldn't be man, it has to be God. We believe the same material signs have appeared on earth today that appeared when Jesus was here. The same pillar of fire that Paul saw with the same nature doing the same thing came in our day. It is God speaking directly to us. The very same spiritual sign that he identified himself as Messiah has identified him today. He is still Messiah. You can only receive these great blessings if you believe every word is thus saith the Lord by pressing play. If you are someone that doesn't believe that, and has to decide intellectually or by someone telling you this is the word of the Lord and this is just Brother Branham speaking, then this isn't for you. In the time that Moses led the children of Israel, there was one that was Moses. The rest of them just followed the message, see? But today for us that do believe it that way, our hearts are so full of joy and bubbling over, we can hardly contain ourselves. I feel that he has redeemed us. I feel that our names are on his book. I believe that we've been redeemed by the blood of the lamb because we do believe this message is God's voice speaking directly to us, we accept this as God himself speaking to us lip to ear. There is no doubt our names are on his book. May I put it like this, the ministry of Jesus Christ reincarnated in his church in the last day. That's what many of us believe. I believe with you. That is exactly how we believe it. Jesus Christ reincarnated, speaking to his bride on tape. Every time we press play, our faith reaches new heights. This isn't just another preacher speaking. This is God himself speaking to us. We only want 100% pure word. Let me ask you something. Is William Marion Branham your pastor? Is he God's vindicated seventh angel messenger? Do you believe what he asked God to do, God did? Do you believe he was the voice of God for this day? You believe every word he said? Then you're going to be blessed once again beyond words Sunday. There's no other way you can receive this blessing unless you're listening to the tapes and believe what you are hearing to be, thus saith the Lord. You must believe what he is saying is God speaking directly to you. 
I, as your pastor, your brother, with what faith I have, I have asked God to place it on you. I believe that I'll receive what I've asked. Now, if you will believe it with me, with what faith that I have, I give to you for this hour. To us, he is our pastor. There is no one in the world that has more or greater faith than our pastor, God's prophet. Now, God's prophet has asked God to give us his great faith. If you believe it with all your heart, it is now your faith. Glory, we do. Our faith might have been weak, but no more, for we now have his faith. And now in the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of God, renounce your affliction, your sickness, and say to it, you have to go. Because you have your faith plus my faith with the power of Jesus Christ, whose omnipresence is here to vindicate it and prove that he is here, will make you well at this time. What can I say that would make you come join us and receive this great blessing. Think of it. Whatever you have need of, you can have it. If you'll come, listen, and simply believe it. Come listen Sunday at 12 p.m. Jeffersonville time. With the bride, we'll be gathering and listening from the east and the west, the north and the south, all at the same time. As thus saith the Lord speaks to us and tells us all about he that is in you. 63-1110E. If you can't listen with us, at the same time Sunday, no matter. Just press play anytime and listen and believe what you are hearing to be the voice of God speaking to you. Brother Joseph Branham. That concludes the letter of Brother Joseph Branham for this day. And I pray that it will be a blessing to you and share the link of this video with your friends and family. We'd love to hear from you. God bless you and Shalom.